hey guys welcome back to the channel this is Catherine with a K today's the 30th of November and look what's just arrived the advent of change so if you remember from my last video I got two of them one by accident but a happy accident as we've called it so this one is um, mainly for children's charities and this one is for every charity and there's a cat walking on the dog Bella, don't do that. Don't walk on them. You'll bend them. Go on. Go on. Oh, Bella. Oh, and that's just some knitting. I'm making a Christmas present. You'll probably see more of that in another video. So, yeah, this one is, is for all different charities. Adults, children's, cancers, etc. So, so this is what it's like on the inside. So... It's like every other calendar, we open it up and count down to Christmas and it'll tell you a different charity that pound has gone to that day. And this one is very similar, but a little bit more child friendly. Yeah, I look forward to opening these, so I'll be doing that tomorrow and seeing what charities lie inside. So I shall see you tomorrow right so it's still the 30th and Paul and I are having um, a really good clear clear out we are doing the entire house before Christmas starts because I want to get the tree up and do the decorations probably sometime next week after I've done my next lot of night shifts so but we, we need to have a sort out so that's what we're doing now. So Paul's concentrating on downstairs. I'm concentrating on upstairs. So at least it'll be spick and span. So that's, by the way, why I look like this. Because, um, sweaty work. Good morning. It is the 1st of December. So Merry Christmas. And what a beautiful day it is as well. So bright. So the plan is, um, I'm going to do the calendars and then have some breakfast, get dressed, and then Paul and I still have um, quite a bit, still a bit of cleaning to do and a bit of tidying. Oh, Miss Bella's just popped up. You want to say hello? Hello. Hi. Isn't it a beautiful day? That's right. So are you nice and warm on that windowsill? Yes. What was I saying? Oh yeah, we're going to do the calendars, we're going to continue clean, and then tonight we are going to do the Christmas tree. I know it might be a little bit early, but some people have been putting them up in October, so I think this is more of an appropriate time, but obviously the reason why people are putting the tree up early was just... Just to bring a bit of joy and a bit of happiness during a really difficult time, so that's what I'm doing. So, um, I shall see you downstairs for the calendar. Calendar time! Right, so we'll do the children's one first. So let's see what it says. Okay, this might be a bit difficult. There we go, number one. I'm just going to put that down. Is here to see what it says. Oh, let's have a look. Leo, let mummy read it. So it is for World Bicycle Relief. Today you have helped give a bicycle to a young girl in Colombia so she can get to school. Oh, that's sweet. Oh, well, that's a good one. I like that. And this one, let's see what that says for day one. Well, let's try and find it. Ah, there it is. Day one. Doing this one-handed is not easy. 
So let's see which one have we got today. A toy box. Today you have given a child living on the streets a hot drink and nutritious meal, bringing them comfort in the cold night. Oh, you know it's awful thinking about children living on the streets. You know it's bad enough for adults, but for children. Not something people like to think about, but unfortunately, that's the reality of it. Right, so. What do you think, baby? Do you, did you like that? I think she did. Right, so back to the cleaning and then tonight it'll be tree time. Right, bathroom's done. Paul's doing the kitchen and then I'm going to be sorting the little bedroom out and doing, um, you know, reorganising the clothes and that. Hey Bella. Hey. I know it might smell a bit different. I hate cleaning bathrooms because of can You just can't seem to get rid of it. Can you? You molting all the time. Oh well, hello. Whoop. Oh. oh God. We've only done a clothes about a week ago and yet they still feel like knives. Yes, hello, Dan. Hello. I know you don't mean to hurt me. Right, so I've been thinking a lot about are you are you gonna jump? Are you gonna jump? <laughs> I've been thinking a lot about Vlogmas and you know, I'm just trying to decide, you know, what I want to put in my videos. I mean, I won't be doing it every day because... Oh, God. You and your nails, madam. Yeah, so I won't be doing it every day because, because I work nights and I can do about three to four in one week. So it won't be practical. And plus with lockdown uh, and then this tier system that's supposed to be coming in place tomorrow or the third um we can't really go anywhere you know like i, I um like ice skating or a christmas market that would have been really a really good like travel vlog in a way but so i will be doing things like christmas films christmas crafts christmas baking i've already decided what I want to do with that. I've seen a few nice recipes that I want to try. So, I mean, I'm going to try and aim to do it maybe two to three, depending on what's happening that week. And obviously, New Year for definite, and Christmas Eve, definitely. So that's the plan. But I will do my best to get it out, because I hate promising something and not being able to deliver. I am a little bit of a perfectionist. If I'm going to do it, I'm going to do it and I'm going to do it right. Otherwise, what's the point? But that's just how I am. So I'm going to crack on now. And then later, before we do the tree, I'm making a plate pie. Which if you're not quite sure what that is, that is um, short pastry with mince and then the vegetables. And it's oh and the crust is really nice with gravy Paul's never had it before it was one of my favorite dishes as a child that my mother used to make and it was so nice but we've not had it since she's unfortunately celiac and i'm lactose intolerant so christmas puddings are fun for her to do right so i will get back to it and i will get back to you so it's tea time now um, I've just started making my um, plate pie, so in here we've got mince with an oxo cube, some salt and um, an onion and when this is cooked I drain, I drain off the water and that'll make the gravy and then I'll put the mince in the pastry, put it in the oven for half an hour and then it'll be ready. I cannot wait, I've never made this before. So, fingers crossed. <laughs>
the end of Logla Vila. Start again. <laughs> That's the end of Vlogmas Day 1. Um, I hope you've enjoyed the video. I know it's not been Christmassy, but we've um, it's preparation for Christmas. Uh, if you've enjoyed it, then press that like button and do subscribe. It will really help my channel out and I shall see you next time.